FCT residents have appealed to government to take appropriate measures to bring down high price of compressed natural gas. ADBN correspondent Ikaita Ibo, who did a survey on how Nigerians have embraced CNG as an alternative to fuel, report. Removal of fuel subsidy may have lofty future benefits for the Nigerian citizenry at the long run. But one cannot deny the fact that the decision, though as good as it may be, has brought hardship upon many Nigerians and their families. Many find it difficult to fill their vehicles due to the present hike in premium motor spirit, popularly known as petrol. In a swift move to alleviate the suffering of Nigerians, President Bola Tinubu approved the presidential CNG initiative to provide cheaper and cleaner fueling alternative for Nigerians. The presidential CNG initiative serves as a component of the palliative intervention of the present administration directed at providing succor to the masses occasioned by the transitive hardship of the fuel subsidy removal. Speaking to ADBN News, Mr. Yakini Kandiri and Abdulaziz Yusuf, who are both auto mechanics, while outlining the numerous benefits of CNG, regretted most Nigerians are yet to key into it. It's, it's not like using gas, just like using fuel. It just reduce the price. That is the money you spend. Maybe the money you spend in a week for fuel. If if you can, if your fuel, if your vehicle is using gas, and it's using fuel, you can fill your tank, and you can still fill your tank for gas. So the way they used to do it was, if your fuel is about to finish, that there's one they call automatic. You switch automatically to the gas. You continue your journey. If you are, if you are, if you are traveling. Initially, I have known my customers, some of my customers who converted them to that. Yes. I can even introduce people to there, something like that. But the issue of that as a customer money is the price, the rate of the price converted, but that is what's going Engineer Victor Oluyole, a car owner and others spoken to, admitted limited knowledge of CNG also lamented not being able to afford conversion due to the exorbitant price. It's very expensive. If government can help, for they should make the price for masses to be able to afford it. But for now, it's on the high side. It's for the rich men, not for the poor, for now. Actually, it's a conversion, it's a conversion of the distance. To change it from fuel to CNG, the cost price is much. Because I, I, make, I make a confirmation, my friend is telling me that it's around one point something million to convert it. That is what stopped me. Actually, I could have changed it to the CNG. Yeah, honestly, if government will look into it and maybe import it and reduce the cost price of the conversion, I think that it will be very, very more easier for we Nigerians. The call on government to take measures that can make it affordable. It may be recalled federal government signed a memorandum of understanding with the Presidential Initiative on Compressed Natural Gas and the National Institute of Transport Technology on the training of technicians on the conversion of petrol and diesel vehicles to CNG-powered vehicles, as well as repairing and maintenance of vehicles. Ikaite Ibut, ADBN News.